Yo, what's good, everybody? Got another beers with Barton. It is uh, Saturday, May 14th, 2022. Hope everyone's doing well. This is day two, or I'd say first full day as a bachelor. Um, Jessica Michaela left last night, or last late afternoon, about 4 o'clock. Um, just kind of hung out yesterday. Um, I'm not going to lie, I got a little bored. Um, had a couple beers, um, had a cigar. Watch some sports, and about 11 o'clock, uh, I was tired and ready to go to bed, which is, you know, during, on like a Monday, it'll be like midnight, and I'm like, one more show, um, I don't know, maybe I was tired from the week, but, uh, being home alone is kind of boring, can be kind of lonely from time to time, but whatever, uh, so I went to bed, probably fell asleep about midnight, um, Michaela was actually sending me requests for more time on TikTok, because her and her friends were, uh, not tired at midnight. Um, I told her it was bedtime, and apparently they finally fell asleep um, sometime after midnight, but they were up at like six. So, anyways, uh, they've been having a good time. So, I woke up about eight. Uh, Potter was ready to get up and uh, do his thing. And then, uh, so I fed him, made a ton of coffee, and just hung out. I actually played some PlayStation today. Uh, first time since the uh, Niners lost to the Rams in the NFC Championship game. I was over uh, Madden. Uh, my heart was still broken, so um, let's see, that was January, so four months later, <laughs> but uh, set up a new Dynasty franchise and kind of hung out and did that, and then um, went and uh, walked up to uh, the local watering hole, um, got some steps in, had a couple beers, and now I'm just hanging out at home, but uh, my buddy called me this morning or texted me and said, hey, you want to go to the Charlotte FC game tonight? Uh, Charlotte has a soccer team, a football team, as they'd say. Um, is an expansion team. It's their first year. They're actually doing pretty well. And uh, since I moved to Charlotte about 15 years ago, um, never really cared about any of the teams out here. I mean, I'm not a big NBA guy anyway. It was the Bobcats. There's no team here when I moved here. And the Bobcats were here because um, the Hornets moved to New Orleans, and they brought the New Orleans or they brought the Hornets back. I don't know five, six, seven years ago. Not a big NBA guy, but cool. I root for the Hornets. Um, I guess I'm a Kings fan. I root for the Warriors. Um, and uh, hockey, I'm a Sharks fan. And uh, Carolina Hurricanes, they're up in Raleigh anyway, about two hours north um, in the capital here in uh, North Carolina. But I don't care about the Hurricanes. Um, they don't have a Major League Baseball team. Closest team is Atlanta. Don't care about Atlanta. I'm a Giants fan. And uh, the Panthers, whatever. I'm indifferent towards them. Um, the Niners and Panthers actually used to be in the same division, the NFC South, like, Oh, man, 20 years ago, 30 years ago, it was uh, Falcons, Saints, Panthers, and the Niners until uh, they added some. So I don't care about the Panthers. Um, but Charlotte FC, the football team, the soccer team here, I feel like it's the first team that's come to Charlotte since I've been here that I can get behind. I do enjoy soccer a ton, um, really enjoy it. Um, so it's their first season, and... Uh, They actually set an attendance record for the first home game about two months ago. I think uh, Bank of America Stadium, where the, the Panthers play, which is where they're playing right now, maybe holds 75, 78,000. I think there was like 65,000 or so. Uh, biggest opening game or biggest attendance in MLS history. Since then, they've closed the upper deck. They keep it to the bottom deck. I think they sit about 38,000, and they've been averaging like 25 to 28,000 a game. So they're still doing great. Anyways, buddy, got some tickets. Asked if I wanted to go. I said I'm down. So uh, it's about 4 o'clock. Uh, the game starts at 7. I think he's going to pick me up about 5.30-ish. Um, he works in Uptown, so we're going to go park at his building and walk over a couple blocks, probably grab a beer, what they call the French Quarter, which is uh, – this cool little spot where it's got like six or eight like little restaurants and bars, uh, some soccer bars. Uh, Charlotte's actually a pretty decent soccer uh, city. So it's going to be pretty cool. We're going to go check it out. Um, hopefully they play a, a Montreal football club, and uh, we'll see how it goes. But game's at 7, game's over at 9. I'll probably be home at like 9.45, 10, ready to sleep or have seven more beers. We'll see how it goes. But uh Pretty excited to check out the game tonight. I've heard the atmosphere is amazing, um, and uh, so that'll be cool. So I thought it was appropriate to not only uh, experience, we'll see how it goes. Maybe tomorrow's beers with Barton will be about the game, but uh, grab some beers this weekend. And this one is a German beer, which is all about football. I thought that was uh, appropriate. This is a Marzen. 
It's a pint, 0 0.09, so 16.9. I've had it before. It's uh, it's delicious. I think it's a, uh, I don't know, five, five, yeah, five point one -er. and it's a uh, a Marzen beer, which are some of my favorites. So I'm gonna enjoy this one right here. I'm gonna go hang out with Potter for a bit, give him some dinner, get myself ready to roll out, go enjoy the Charlotte FC MLS soccer, MLS football game. And uh, the weather's perfect. It was supposed to rain. It did not. Um, it's nice and cool. It's probably, I don't know, 70s, but a uh, nice little breeze. It'll be perfect tonight. So excited about it. Uh, I do miss my family. It always sounds awesome to have some time to yourself, which is, it is nice to, to, to have time to yourself and do your own thing. But uh, it's nice to have the family around. But they're having a blast. Uh, the weather's perfect. They're going shopping, getting good dinner tonight, and uh, spend all day at the beach with perfect weather. So good for them. And I'll be home tomorrow, probably late afternoon, um, early evening. It's about a four-hour drive, so um, they're staying at uh, the friend whose birthday it is. Um, I think the family owns a beach house. They didn't have to rent anything, which is cool, so they don't have to, like, rush to get out. So who knows when they'll get home, but I uh, hope they'll have a blast. Drive safe, and, um, you know, I'll be looking forward to seeing you. So tonight, Charlotte FC uh, football soccer game. Um, pretty cool. My buddy uh, found some tickets, so looking forward to that. I'll drink to that. Cheers. Oh, that's a beautiful beer. Pairs perfectly with this cigar that I'm having. I am enjoying the weather. I'm enjoying the peace and quiet. Uh, minus Potter, who... There's no peace and quiet about him. Um, except he got up early this morning, went outside and threw up. He must have gotten into something last night. I'm not sure what it was. Um, but he does that anyway. I mean, he's got such a sensitive stomach. And uh, so we've been giving him some Benadryl. So he's been kind of out of it. So uh, he's been napping all day. And I'm sure he'll enjoy some peace and quiet to himself while I'm gone tonight. So cheers. Uh, cheers, Charlotte FC. Looking forward to it. I look up in the sky and there's some dark clouds actually looking like they may roll in. We'll see. But we're going. We're doing it. Go Charlotte FC. My first, actually my first MLS soccer game ever. I've been to a couple uh, EPL, English Premier Leagues. They did like a Guinness um, uh, exhibition type game with some Premier League teams. It was like, I think I saw Liverpool and AC Milan, which is from Italy. Um, we did that a couple years in a row. But it's been a while. First MLS game, so I'm looking forward to it. So go Charlotte. I'm going to buy myself a hat. Excuse me, and a shirt if I can find it. I'll spend $100 on uh, $18 worth of material, and I'll love every second of it. All right, everybody. Have a good rest of your night. Go Charlotte. It's the only Charlotte team I care about. Until next time. Adeuces.